What is up? I'm Moana Turtle, and today we have a Yu-Gi-Oh opening. We got another one of these gold sarcophagus tins. Still very happy with this product. Oh, you can kind of see my reflection with my super secret setup with a phone on a tripod. What? But uh, yeah, if you have not been able to get your hands on one of these, I heck recommend you go check out uh, LGS or local retailer to pick up at least one of them. I feel like they are a pretty good deal. The, it's not like a lot of sets where it's like a lottery, it's, you know, Thanos Dragon or Bust, Infinite Impermanence or Bust, you know, oh, if you don't get two hand traps or more, it's a bust. There are so many cards in here to pull that are, you know, so many potential hits, and if you can string two of them, you know, I think you get, that's, it makes the, uh, the box, the tin, worth it. So it's very doable. Ooh, Red Eyes Alternate Black Dragon. That looks pretty nice. The thing that we are chasing the most, so I think like Nibiru might be still like the most expensive card, but we want one of all the gods. We have all but Slifer, which is the main one, <laughs> although I really like Obelisk. And still want, I would love to get my hands on a no name error mis misprint uh, promo card. Still don't know much about them. God, look how many cards are in this thing. This is Yu Gi Oh! too. Alright, let's get into our first pack. That's what we're here to do. We got Paladin of the Storm Dragon. F.A. Dark Dragster. Like a Batmobile kind of thing. Jack Jaguar. Cybernetic Overflow. Solomon Great Mirror. The Deep Grave. Alright, then we got hers. It's like chips. Crystal Keeper. White Stingray. Goki. Koki Pole, <laughs> Vampire's Desire, Koki Ring Trainer. I feel like the cards are sticky. Dragoonity Coast. All right, Cyber. Excuse me. Wee Witch's Apprentice. Never, never a big fan of these. Vampire Sucker. I don't remember what set you're from, but I think we pulled to you at one point. And for first pack, we have Effect Monster, Iron Dragon Ty Tiamatan. I think this was a pretty good hit in its original set. I don't remember what it is. Not a home run, but I think it's a solid pull. And we got our wrong sleeves. These are the Pokemon sleeves. Let me just flip this box upside down. Then boom. There we go. All right, let's get into pack number two. As always guys, if you do enjoy the video, do me a favor, hit that like button down below and let me know how your own polls are going. If you, uh, let me know if you're having trouble finding the product. I kind of haven't heard that there's like a shortage of supply or anything, so I feel like it's readily available. I mean, even the 2018s are still available at like Target or Walmart. All right, Incantation Talismandra. I've never seen that one. All right. Edge Imp Cotton Ears, that eater, eater, that's, name gets weirder and weirder. Boy Cotton, what on earth? Vendra Daybreak, Predablast, Gate Gravekeeper Spiritualist, alright, then we have the Taos Mandra, Some Summon Summoner, <laughs> ooh, Nightmare Cerberus, not bad, and, oh, Danger Jackalope, is that the, is that the one everyone's looking for? Alright, so I just confirmed, this is one of the chase cards right now. I think Boral Sword is the only one that's a little bit higher than him. And I'll leave it right here. I feel like Dangers, because of this set, uh, I've word on the street has become much more affordable to play and Dangers is something that you can kind of mix into any deck. So it's not like just Danger, you can play something else and have some Danger cards in there as well. So very happy with that pull. <coughs> See what that's what I mean. Like these these tins, it's not very difficult to get pulls that are make it like worth purchasing. Where more often than not, like you, the chance of you kind of comparing if you were to pick up singles on the secondary market versus just pulling uh, opening packs, the this tin is pretty good in that respect. DDD Flame High King Genghis, and this is our last pack already. Let's get something good. 
I want to get a Thunder Dragon Colossus. I'm pretty sure that card's in this set as well. World Legacy Struggle. There's that DDD Flame High King. Trickstar Bloom is the rare. Nightmare Gryphon is the ultra. And boom! Galaxy Eye Solar Flare Dragon. Hmm. Not familiar with this one. I'm gonna sleeve up that bad boy just in case. And on to the promos. It's ah, that's that's another awesome thing about this set. It's like the promos actually are really cool to open because they're different every time. Oh, I really want one of these um, no-name cards. And oh, I love that art. Palladium Oracle Mana. Slifer, yes. Okay, we got all the all the guy cards now, and uh, now I just want something without a name. Dimension Shifter. Let's grab a sleeve for good old Slifer. All right, so pretty good opening. Not sure about this Galaxy Eyes, but the time. Taya Matan is okay. Slifer Sky Dragon, and then our big hit, Danger Jackalope. Yeah, I'm not sure why this guy's so dangerous, but uh, either way, very successful opening. And um, yeah, as always, guys, thanks for watching. If you haven't stopped by the Discord, there's a link right down below. All that, guys, like, comment, and subscribe, all down below. I'm Moana Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time.